hello guys welcome back to my channel uh, in this video tutorial session we're gonna see how you can run your streamlit application using google Colab. okay so uh streamlit is used for web applications to develop web applications and also you can equally use uh flask or you can decide to use django but i prefer to use streamlit because it's quite easy to uh, work with so uh, google collab is mainly used for machine learning and ai projects if you want to do an ai project and you want to run uh, your machine learning model that is when you're going to use collab most of the times so collab offers the users free gpu and tpu runtimes so if you want to build a web application and you want to use collab to run the application uh, you need to use streamlit utility and the first in the first cell you need to install streamlit by using the code pip install streamlit so once you install streamlit um, the next installation is PyNG rock which is um, a utility that enables you to create a local tunnel in order to host your application so once we install PyNG rock uh, the next step will be to write to your code so in this tutorial i decided to use a very simple piece of code which is just a uh, hello world uh, to display in the, on the application so after you write a piece of code at the very first line you need to add this uh, write file app.py so what it does is that it saves it saves this uh, 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 application that is it saves this code uh, in the sandbox as you can see this is it app.py so that is what it does so once you do that the next thing is going you, you will need to get an authentication token from ng rock so you need to go to the ng rock platform and uh, you create a new account and in your dashboard you're going to you are going to find your authentication token which you, which you're going to use then after that you need to um, uh, download and save ng rock so this is the the link to download uh, ng rock on your sandbox after you download ng rock you unzip ng rock which is here and finally uh, you need to run this piece of code in order to create the local host uh, for your application to run online on collab once it is done you're going to find this link but uh, you're not supposed to click on the link until you run your application using the the code streamly run app.py so when you do that you're going to have a network url and external url so you don't click on any of these now you go back and you click on this one so that is what i've done and uh, this is the outcome of the application so you see hello world which is exactly what uh, has been developed in our application here so guys that is it um, basically what uh, the application does uh for those who want to proof i think if i can click again uh yeah that is it please wait hello world that is it right so basically this is what uh, you can do to run your application online so uh the main difference is at this level if you want to write more complex code if you want to write more uh, i don't know more complex code then you can uh, modify this piece of code but uh, uh, you need to add the first line to write this file after part then you're gonna have this one here so guys thank you very much for watching uh, if you have any questions you can always ask i'll be happy to answer your questions so thank you very much and god bless you all thank you